general demo instructions how to use turbo decoder SIP22 uh, specific high precision self impressioning tool for open locks of uh, Fiat Alfa Romeo Lancia and Iveco uh, the tool come in this uh, box inside you feel you will found the book to write the code when you open the lock our trademark certificate in turbo decoder and two set of devices with uh, SIP 22 stamped on it with calibrated dimension of the needle to put the pins in the start position the tool has a metal profile SIP 22 tension ring tension wheel, pin access wheel and pump wheel. Here we have a hologram sign with the serial number our company and here we have uh, again our company and uh, turbo decoder serial number and model. This is the signs of originality of the tool. And the invert inventor of this device and I'm gonna show you how to apply the procedure. The first thing you have to reset the pins. The pins are sliding into itself when they get the code, make it possible to lock or unlock the impact the lock. To reset the pins, go forward with this wheel, turn completely to the right the back wheel, and only with this, by keep the tool like this go in those holes which are at the side of the key blade inject that needle here and push the shoulder of the device will stop exactly in the code number one the first cut the italians uh, have not number but letter they call it uh, cut a Pull back and you will see all of your pins in A position, start position or maximum high position. Basically we have a virgin key and we start from virgin key with cut number one on it. The lock, before to start clean the lock with W40 to be sure that all discs move freely. Then. Let's start the procedure. About the two orientation. The first thing we have to go to the right, push to the front and keep the two on the middle ring. Insert into the lock. When we touch the bottom of the lock, from here push forward. If nothing happened, we can try this extract. I reverse the two, insert again and check from here if we see this movement it means that our tool is not correctly inserted and it means also that we have 8 disc lock because there is a 7 disc lock with missing first, first pin and we will never see that movement no matter how we insert the tool if we see this just we have to click like this extract a reverse and start the procedure. Check, nothing happened. Pull back manually this. One, two, and three. Three stop sectors. The procedure is simple. Just on the front wheel, apply tension to the right. Rotate the back wheel, line to one. Go back, lose the tension, and again, tension, one, back, and loose. Repeat that movement for 20 times. Every time stop at one, not further. When you finish that amount of pumps by stop at the first number, if the opening not happen, we have to increase the rotation of the back wheel and point line to the second stop sector and stay there for 20 more pumps 
if we miss the opening also on second sector we have to increase the rotation to 3 and make 10-15 pumps on 3 if there is no opening just extract reset and try again as you see we have opened now on the second stop sector the lock turn in fact you can see that it's like a key here all discs are in the diameter of the cylinder to extract the tool from the lock obligatory turn in neutral lock position turn to the right the back wheel and now we have to close the pin axis by push forward this ring that can happen only in neutral lock position definitely we will hear click and that will go in only in that way you can extract the tool from the lock attention steering wheel lock directly we never can open it because here is a sidebar but when we open the door we can go and turn the ignition because here the code is imprinted now the only thing we have to orientate the tool how just insert don't forget to keep it on the middle ring during that insertion you see this movement of the lock when we insert it wrongly When we insert it wrongly, that spring will pull out the lock and we will see this movement. When we insert it correctly, all the way in, now the, the lock stay, stay inside. When we see this, it means that the tool is correctly inserted. Just click the back wheel and turn the lock. Is matter of orientation. To extract the tool, come to the left completely, go to the right completely and push this to the front. Only now you can get out from the lock. Code reading. The handle of the tool, first disc, second, third and so to eight. The first disc is closer to the handle which is this, this one. Okay. Reference lines along the key blade. The point of the pin. If it's on the first line, is cut number 2 or B. If it's on the third line, uh, the second line is cut number C or 3. 2 again, B. Third line, 4 but the code you have to read it like this first pin is here you read b right here b the second pin is from the other side second line c a b c here right c the third is on the first pin side here the four is here and so on. When you fill up all this uh, chart, you will have a mechanical code of the lock. To open another lock, we have to reset the tool and try another lock. Uh, we recommend to use this to clean the lock before to start the procedure because those locks are with remote control and they never or almost never use the mechanical key and probably inside you will found a dirty discs and that not not is good for the opening procedure with this i'm finished if you have questions about uh, usage of uh, sip22 just let me know by email 
Thank you for your attention and good luck with our original Turbo Decoder devices.